Hi, it's Lisa. In this video, I'd like to talk about body image. And this video was prompted by a comment that I received. It was a comment by someone who wanted to know my measurements for my waist and my thighs. And they were saying that I have a perfect body and I, I am their goals. And um, it's really flattering and thank you so much that you comment such nice things. And for anyone who comments really nice things about me and how I look, I appreciate it. It does make me feel good. The main thing that I want to say through my what I eat videos and things like that are titled how to be a skinny mini it's not to tell people that they need to be skinny or to have a waist like mine or legs like mine it's basically to promote a plant-based diet as a diet that will help you to be the healthiest and the leanest that you'd want to be and um, it's not to make anyone feel inadequate about what they look like or about their weight and I think the most important thing is that you are vegan and that you are beautiful on the inside it doesn't matter if you're overweight it's about how healthy you are and just having positive thoughts about yourself and not trying to be like someone else so definitely be inspired by other people, even I am inspired, but don't get too obsessed with numbers and the scales or the measuring tape. So I did reply to the comment that asked for my measurements and I said that providing my measurements wouldn't be helpful information. It's not that I'm embarrassed about uh, my measurements or anything, I just don't think it would be helpful to give the numbers because I feel like if I was to give the inches of my waist or the inches of my thighs that people would start comparing their own thighs to mine or their waist to mine and that's not productive thinking so instead of making your goal a certain number on a scale or a measurement on a measuring tape make it a fitness goal like a mountain to climb or a certain number of days of the week to exercise or the number of push-ups you can do, or the number of squats you can do. So make them achievable things like that, rather than things that you don't even know if you'll be able to achieve, like the measurement of someone else's waist. Because our bodies are all different, we don't have to um, achieve a body that we see on a screen, or on Instagram, or even on YouTube. Because I, I think that's too superficial to try to look like someone else. Um, you should be grateful for the body that you have. And I'm not saying that you're not grateful if you made a comment like, like that how I look good and stuff. But just um, keep things in perspective and know that my intention isn't to tell people to be skinny but to just promote a healthy message.